Welcome to Coastal Update, presented to you by the Kevin Corcoran team. Our team stays on top of the market every day to help you make great real estate choices. Let's take a look at the market. This is our 10-month report for the Foley, Alabama and these surrounding cities area for the single-family detached market. We've gathered all the data from the Ball Realtors database, so let's take a look at the first 10 months of 2023. This chart shows inventory. 407 units were shown as active in our MLS system on November the 1st. Down from a peak we saw somewhere around November and December the end of last year, but a slight uptick from the last few months. This chart shows the median days on the market, how long it takes to get a properly priced property under contract from the day it's listed. That stood at 26 days. Less than a month we're putting things that are priced right in the Foley area under contract. This chart represents home sales on a month-by-month -month basis for the last two years, with 129 homes changing hands in the month of October, a slight downtick from the last three months. This is the first 10 months of 2023 versus the same time period last year. Total homes sold down 10% to 1,500. The average sales price rose 9% to $338,000. The median price rose 7% to just over $300,000. Average dollars per heat and cooled square foot rose 8% to 182. Then we look at demand by seeing how many homes are under contract or pending, those that we expect to see closed in the next 30 to 45 days. That stood at 169, which is down about a third from the same time last year. We know there's a lot of angst out there right now about interest rates, but when you see the prices are rising in our area, you may want to consult with your mortgage expert to decide whether it's okay to take a higher rate now and refinance when the market allows and not pay a higher price if you wait. Here at Remax of Gulf Shores, we stand ready to help you out. So contact us right away and we'll help you make great decisions. Thanks for watching Coastal Update and we'll see you next month.